Greetings, my friends. More breaking news. I've never heard of anything like this in my entire life. Never seen anyone like Obama in my entire life. You know that John Boehner, the crying speaker, uh, anything would make him cry. All he had to do is be awake and look outside the window and see the leaves on the trees below. He'd cry. Stopped being speaker. And now they want Paul Ryan to be speaker. And this is what blows me away. Paul Ryan told the GOP today, and by the way, the Democrats are coming out in droves supporting Paul Ryan. Yeah, go figure. He came out today and told the Republicans, if you will rally behind me in supporting all of Barack Hussein Obama's agenda in his last year plus in office, then I'll be speaker. They are rallying around him. They are going to support Obama. This is unbelievable. The government is set up to have a Democratic and Republic and Republican. <coughs> They're supposed to counter balance each other, keep each other in check, and the court system is supposed to keep things in check in the Supreme Court, but Obama owns the Supreme Court. He now owns the Republicans. He's going to own the Speaker soon, which is going to make the entire party who are already agreeing to his terms rally around him. This is just unheard of. You need to wake up and understand the America that you grew up with is gone. It is never going to return. America is a great whore of Babylon, and God has already said, he will destroy the great whore of Babylon after the imminent harpazo, catching away, rapture, whatever you want to call it. Bottom line is this. Obama's the Antichrist. Believe what you want. I've got all the proof. I've got 136 things to prove it. If you've never been saved or you're backslidden, I've got a prayer. Pray the prayer. Do the six vital next steps. It's found in the comments box below the video title. And do it as soon as possible. No one's guaranteed any more time in their life. Also, in that box is my tribulation survival guide video. It tells you how to get saved and what to expect in the tribulation. If you'd like me to pray for you for anything, contact me and I'll pray for you every day. Christians, remember, we are seed planters. We witness, pray, and walk away. God and Jesus do all the work. It's between them and God afterwards. Don't beat them over the head with the Bible. It doesn't work. That's not how it's supposed to be. But true Christians, look up. Our redemption draweth nigh. We fly soon. Have a blessed day. Share this breaking news with everybody you possibly can. Bye.